What a strange video game I'm playing right now. I must say. After stuff like that. So we could go do the next thing over there and get the next uh, emblem ring. Well, there's a paralogue over here. And if I know one thing from playing Fire Emblem games, it's that we gotta go and play paralogues. I was thinking about, like, what kind of messed up joke can I make about this? About, uh, <laughs> about if I know one thing about Fire Emblem, but I couldn't come up with something in time. But yeah, suggested base class level 4. Wait. So, like, our rough level should be 4 to do that, so level 4. 1, but he's promoted, so it doesn't matter. 3, 4, 7, 5, 5, 7, 8, 7. We're probably pretty good and stuff. So, this... We'd get iron and steel by going there. We'd get uh, orange, wheat, flour, potato, and rice. And I guess it's going up because uh, I did the donations there. Because, yeah, for any donation level 3 stuff. Um, wait, can I get, like, rewards that I missed in uh, previous things? Oh. So I can go to these places. I guess because there's still areas that I can explore. So I can, like, gather materials and stuff there. So I can now go and get the Kalisan Chicken and Mare Donkey? Donkey there? How, uh, how do I go there? Press A. I don't know. Something to figure out for some other time. Is the case. Yeah. So I guess begin chapter, continue the story, even though this is a paralogue. So we technically don't have to do it to, uh, beat the story? Let's see what's going on here. Loading. Ah! Paralogue, budding talent. So... This has got to be where we get our villager, then, if it's called Budding Talon. These pills are to it has to be. Let me know if the pain persists, okay? And you're looking chipper today. I told you that cold would This is where we get Donald slash Mozu. Father, isn't it time you took a break? Look, I made you some tea. Thank you, John. You didn't burn yourself or anything preparing it, I hope. You worry too much. I'm old enough to manage a simple pot of tea, I assure you. <laughs> it makes me happy to see you growing up so fine. Huh? What's going on out there? Doctor, you have to help us. Monsters are on the attack and people are getting hurt. What the devil are those beasts? This will get ugly. John, go and hide. I'll take care of bringing people to the clinic. This way, everyone! If you're unhurt, then assist someone who is injured. We must pull together. I know father told me to hide, but how can I? I have to do my part too. I swear if it's like awakening where I need to give you a level up or else I don't recruit you. I'm fairly certain that was- No, wait, wait it was the case of Fates with Mozu too, wasn't it? Now that I think about it. Yeah. So it probably would actually end up being like a- I'm probably gonna need him to get a level up this battle, and then he'll join me. Oh no! Or else he won't. <laughs> I don't know why I find it amusing at even get showing like his model the down there. The Just to say, Arar. Keep your wits about you, everyone. I'll patch you up once the crisis has passed. <laughs> don't worry, I'll heal you after you get stabbed. Corrupted on the loose. Let's save those villagers. So I can only right? bring in a six, Get to safety and seven on this one. Oh, I start saying six. You don't have to tell me twice, but there's still a few left who didn't make it out in time. We'll do everything in our power to save as many of them as we can. They'll love you for it if you do. You're the last hope at this point. Okay, so yeah, this one, the unit selection is actually going to matter. Everybody out, we're having a look at the map first. What are we dealing with here? Um, yeah, so a bunch of dudos that are around level 7, it seems like. There's even mage guns in the Corrupted. That kind of sucks, and we're going to have to rush over there. Oh. oh, all the way over here, the map goes on decently far, huh? So I wonder where Gene is going to spawn. Because he's not over here. He's probably going to end up spawning over by our side somewhere. In fact, maybe he'll take up this slot right here. You know, on Fire Emblem stuff. Uh, you give me a full axe and stuff. Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, more not risen. A bunch of people have died over there and stuff. Um. So, I mean. As 
crummy as it feels like to bring my pre-promoted unit and not the, uh... I might just have to. Not everyone else that could use the experience more. Might well be handy. So I could always give the emblem rings to someone else, but just bring my current emblem ring users. And then, like... Are there enemy flyers? Hold on. How plentiful are enemy flyers? How important is it to bring Etsye? There's one enemy flyer. Just the one, though. But it could also just be handy to attack at range without having to worry about being counter-attacked. It is also worth noting. Is also the plus in that. So, like... I'll bring you anyway, then. And then, uh... Can I do it without, uh... Without you and give the experience to those who need it more? Maybe. Hmm. 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 I wish I could move my unit there. I wish. See if he's baited out by Louise there. We shall see if that ends up being the case. I don't know. My unit can go try to bait out this guy and stuff. Um, or one of those guys. In which case we do something like that for you to bait out that guy. In which case, I can go ahead and actually... I do end up going with this setup. Okay, let's see here. Let's see what we can do about... No! No, 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 Nothing else I need to do, right? I don't think so. I think we're good. Okay. There are so many wounded we couldn't get to the clinic. Is it up to me to treat them all? Yeah... Father, oh, I'm here to help. If we split up, we can treat everyone. I'm probably sure. gonna need to chat to you with Alir. You to run and you know how fire emblem works. I you know. can't stay hidden away when there are so many who need my help. Yeah, I need to go After over there. All, Father, am I not your son? You taught me that a doctor does whatever is needed. My Please, uh, in, I may I have some more? Very well then. Come and give me a hand. Talking is now in the guide. Yeah. We've had talking available in a previous map, but I guess some players might not have noticed how a talking works. So I've got this. I assume, yeah, I've got the one with the speech bubble. Yep, it is indeed those rules then. Okay, in which case, I live to serve. Yeah, so we can come over here, and let's see if he's dumb enough to shove his face right into the rider's bane. Let's see what's going on with that. And then I may as well go here and visit. Don't know how much you shall get out of this, but every little bit helps, right? Yeah. Defense tonic. Huh, well, it's something. I'm gonna send it to the convoy, though. I don't really need it. Hmm. Yeah, I don't need to use the uh, blocking finger bob right now. Oh yeah, I was thinking about moving a you there and my unit taking these guys actually. I'm ready for more. It doesn't really matter who takes who, I don't think. Um. Yeah, just keep on holding on to that in that case. The divine dragon looked at me. Let's have units fight close by and uh, peace. build a bond and stuff. I'm ready. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna do something like this, I think. We're gonna schmoove here and hope that they come over to my units. Like, that guy isn't, because he can't anyway. Hopefully this wall holds for a little while, because uh, they'll be healing over there. You're coming over, at least. What the heck? Ow, literally half my health. Yikes. Yeah, maddening mode is kind of scary, honestly. No, you're not coming along. That sucks. You do not want to run right into the rider's bane. Okay, that's actually kind of unfortunate, then. It's just the guys that can't reach the villagers. Miss, please. Gosh dang it. I'm swing over half my health and I can't even do over half his. Ugh, sucks to suck, man. Go heal. 
Yeah. Yeah, just form the uh, body shields there of the area. There we go. But yeah, we are going to have to kind of semi-rush over there then. It seems like. But first I should deal with this area. I could hit both of them if I engage Sigurd. I don't know how worth it it would be exactly. <sighs> One, two, three, four. If I take out you, I can break that guy. That would give me a pretty good opening. If I do this here, I can kill, but only while I'm close to the Divine Dragon for that bonus there. And I'm out of range from that mage. This works out perfectly, assuming the 92 hits. I need to take this opportunity while I'm here. Not getting an opportunity that good again if I reposition my units. Alright, which means my other units are free keep to uh, do something over here. 75, 85. I may as well go for this. Like that. Ooh, I was on the verge of tears. <laughs> and then that frees up my unit to go over here and break. I kind of wish that attack was the default first option rather than uh, rather than engage. How am I getting 45? This is just a regular attack, right? Oh, grants attack plus three for one turn if user has 50% HP or less at start of turn. I'm getting... But that wouldn't make it 45. What's making my attack so high? Hold on. So 18 break, 9, 18 from like speed I'm getting from Marth. It's not gonna question it. I guess you just die. I was fully expecting to break you and then finish you off with someone else. And we got a crit. Wow, okay. Um, Axu's long handle helps reach mounted foes, so it's effective against mounted foes there. So we can yoink that from the convoy with you if we, uh, if we decide that's a thing that we want there. Oh, but you... Oh, gosh darn you. Well, let's just hope that that guy comes over me then. Yeah. Darn it. I cannot move into that mage's range. No way, Jose. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Maybe it's worth sticking around at less than 50% HP if I can hit like a truck as long as no enemy hits me back. Maybe? I don't know. Would it be worth it there? Alright, yeah. Be going around that way. That archer might just move in over there, but the mage is gonna come over to us. Like, if that mage wasn't there, I could, uh, keep on running in there. Oh, that's not great, is it? That's really not great. Huh. Oh, that stupid mage hadn't interfered with my plans. Oh. Oh, that's really bad. That's really bad, actually. That, yeah, that's really, really bad. That's the guy I gotta recruit. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Sounds like I'm going to need to... Okay. I still live a little bit longer. But it does sound like I am going to need to do something stupid this turn. And I can do that. Like, don't doubt my ability to do something stupid. Emblem don't game. doubt it. So, yeah, this is going to be my hardest hitting thing here. I can take out that archer. And that guy's almost going to be down. Not quite enough yet. So we're going to go ahead and do this to form a little bit of a wall over here. To help protect the villagers. By skedaddling over to this side. Like that. Okay. Yeah. Alright, so that's a max like bond and thingrabob next time. Yeah, we chill here for a little bit of a wall. Meanwhile, we do this. Please. I can't kill though. I can kill that guy, and I this guy is not going to be able to take out anyone in one fell swoop anyway. It's like that might work, and there's no way I can get the divine dragon bonus because how am I going to get a leer over there? You know. It ain't happening. 
Ha. I won't get lost. Okay. Ooh, we can just one-shot this guy. <laughs> nice. Is it over? Okay. Of curiosity. Is my damage still insane? You know, I guess that one unit just had like really pathetic defense. So it's gonna be worth healing up for me, I'm fairly certain. Probably worth slapping that on. Yeah, so I may as well like go ahead and do this then. And yeah, I guess we're finishing off the one guy that we can, lend some support over here. Make sure that our villager doesn't die. We can't let Donald 2.0, Mosey 2.0, insert any other fire villager 2.0 die here. The villager for this game, you know? We can't let him die. So yeah, there's no way you do enough damage. Any one of us there. I think it was a thing in three uh three houses where you could um you know, directly see with the combat forecast how much damage they do to you. Or am I losing my mind? That would have been nice to see there, but I'm sure we'll be fine. Actually, wait. No, it just shows how much damage I do to you. Uh, then vice versa. Stop being on obstruct by default. Can I, like, rearrange here? Arrange. Oh. Gosh. Arrange just moves it to, like, that slot there. All right. Just that uh, this is the default first thing, so I don't accidentally obstruct in my mashing A of trying to heal. You know? That is absolutely something that would happen to me. Okay. 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 Don't worry. We good here. We good here. Oh, they're ganging up on that guy to take him out. Hopefully it's not a map that gives you more bonuses the more of them you save, because I'm not exactly doing super well on that front, but at least we'll get our villager. That's the important part here. I need to form more of a wall over there, like, stat. That's what I kind of need to do. So, I mean, I can... <sighs> I could do this. And this does seem like the play here. And then it'll block that other guy. That other guy will break me, which is going to be a little bit concerning, but, uh... I will protect you. It's not too big a deal. I don't really have a tile where... This will just still block you anyway. I can be here and I can get whatever the heck this is. Antitoxin. It's a shame I can't quite do that. Oh, I should have stopped, like, a tile closer. Then I would have been a... That would have been fair game for me to do this. I kill you with Echo? You'd live with like one HP. Huh. Well, crap. Oops. Yeah, I actually screwed up, as it turns out. That mage is screwing with me. Why it says you can't move at all? Wouldn't you still be able to move this way? And you should be able to move through. I don't get it. Uh, not worth. Like I could just use the time undo thing. We have plenty of uses. There. Screw it. I will. Screw it, because I was just a little bit silly there. Okay, so go ahead and do this. If like this that. Is a crime. Yeah, actually do chill here after all. So that we can do this. To do some good damage and stuff. Like that. Okay. I like the reference to how magic worked in a Echoes there with you know, hit harder, take a, take an HP off. Okay. Yeah, because we'd be pretty good from here. Huh. So then. My unit might have to stick around there. 
or I send Etsy all the way around here, which would suck, but I might just have to do it. Just because, like, it takes extra, uh, extra time to get into there. Well, sucks to suck, I guess. Guess I'm not gonna be attacking that flyer with my bow. Here goes. Okay. Um. Yeah, that I only have something effective against armored. I don't have anything effective against cavalry there, so I'll just wait here. And then, yeah, stabs are cheap. I have plenty of them now. <laughs> Thank you. Do this to get experience wherever we can for our healer, because, you know, where else am I going to be getting this experience? I figure. I don't know how often I'm going to be punching things on this difficulty. Oh, no! Yeah, there's a break. Okay. Okay. Only 55% chance to hit. Nice! Thanks, Orchard! Thank you for letting me dodge that. Okay. Not doing as much damage to uh, Alfred as I honestly thought you would. Maybe they had toned down the difficulty for the paralogs compared to the main battles or something or other. I don't know. I guess I can just dip back in this case. Get some experience here. I have to come around one way or another anyway. Huh. How to handle things here, I wonder. I really like being able to hover over an enemy like that and see all their stats on the bottom. Like, it's something that you would have been able to do on, like, the 3DS games at the bottom of the screen. I like what they did here with the UI. I think it's nice. Hmm. If we can take out you... Yes, we can! Assuming the 83 hits. Yes! Then we can wall here. That's what we can even do. I don't know why you're stuck there. I don't know what the heck is going on with that. I would not be able to do any damage there. I'm thinking maybe I will, because this will free up my unit to start moving in. That's what I'm thinking here, you know. Peace. That's what I'm thinking here. So yeah, we definitely didn't need a... Vander. I forgot his name for a hot second there. I was gonna say Frederick. There was a plus three. Turn it off a little bit late. I wonder if I could have done it with the javelin. Too late now. Get some experience where we can. Like this. Thank you. There we go. Gotta level up here soon. Hopefully start getting more of those good level ups I've heard about. Instead of my plus ones that I've been getting. Oh! This is a good opportunity to echo, actually. Because I can go ahead and attack this guy and then attack the other guy. That's what I can do. Okay. Allow your soul the rest it deserves. So that guy's taken out. There we go. Neat. Magic proficiency. Cool. And then we do this little smidge of damage here. Like this. Kind of weird camera angle there. Yeah, you're not getting over here anytime turn? soon. This will make it a little bit more tricky for you. Nah, you'll just be able to fly around the wall. Doesn't make that much difference. Um, yeah, this just... This is the 17. If I do steel lands, you can do big damage to me because you get to double with the uh, speed situation. But I can kill you with this. 87. 87. 92. Okay. So we are actually able to take you out after all with the use of Echo there. Nice. Very nice. I wonder what's going on with, like, the fans here. Okay, well, plus four. I would prefer them going up in things that he has a little bit lower. Some things that he has, like, lower growth rates in. Thousand G's, I'll take it. Grab that. Okay. Okay. Oh, well. Oh. Hopefully that wasn't anything too great. It was just like a tonic in the other one, so I assume that that's nothing too crazy. What's the name of this paralogue? I can always look it up just to make extra sure. 
if it's like if it turns out to be something like boots hey, you know thanks. i doubt it would turn out to be that but you know <laughs> just in case it is all right everything runs out but we can get it back here budding talent let's see here fire emblem engage budding talent let's just, let's just see here um Killing the budding talent paralog. Just tell me what the uh, what's in the houses. Just tell it to me. Beat all enemies. Yada yada. Uh, entering the house in the south will reward you with a defense tonic and an energy drop. Wait, what? I did not get an energy drop for doing that. Should have watched the end of your turn to avoid being ambushed. Is that an energy drop over there. In which case, that is a pretty good item, but not like. I assume that with like DLC maps and stuff, and even just regular skirmishes, it's probably going to be possible to, you know, get stuff like that. Set boosting items like energy drops, but uh... Let's see here. Control F on this other page. Energy drop. Visit the right house for an energy drop. Okay. That is actually a pretty good item. But it's not as good as something like boots where it's like, I need to get it, you know? It's not a need. So I'm not gonna bother. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, house there. Yeah, so you're just not moving. Wow, sucks, man. Level five, level six, level four. So my unit actually needs some experience more than uh, more than some of these other guys, honestly. If I fight close to some other dudos, though, we can get some uh, some bonuses and things. Let's see here. Yeah, so we can basically just use this turn to get our bearings. This archer is the only one that we need to worry about, off. and we can take you out like easy peasy. You know, please be a good level up. Please be a good level up. Let's see what it is. The answer is plus two. Gosh. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's see here. Oh man. He just threw an axe and missed. Nice crit. Victory is mine. Yeah, but I need some experience and stuff. Okay, should- Oh, no, I shouldn't, because this guy here is here to ruin my day if I do. But, I can do this. <laughs> sure, let's just do this then. Let's just poke him from afar in that case. Probably not a half-bad plan then. Short knife. Sets the convoy, I don't need it right now. What's our move? Our move is to pull back for now. You wink the thing, Bobs. So yeah, I could have probably done this without losing any units and getting that energy drop in the bottom right, but I'm not gonna redo the entire map for an energy drop. <laughs> Even though that's a pretty nice item, you know, it's not so nice that it warrants redoing a map. You know, we're gonna win in three turns anyway, so like I may as well, right? My muscles are your. I don't know. <laughs> Just for funsies. Do something like this. Why, oh, are you the commander? Random archer? Do something or other here? Imagine if I got the 1% crit, the map ended, and I didn't recruit this guy because I didn't chat with him. Imagine for a hot second if that happened. I still can't even get over there to chat with him. This is ridiculous. What is the uh, conditions? Wrote the enemy. Okay, yeah. Okay. Like, may as well. We'll win in three turns anyway. There's no reason not to. Look, we can do enough here. We can do enough with this. Nice. There we go. Like that. Sweet. Get dissolved into red Cheerios, nerd. Sweet. Please be a good level up. Please be a good level up. Please, oh, please, oh, please. I beseech you! Oh. Plus three. My name's Luck. Basically, like a plus 2.5 in my eyes. Uh. <laughs> There's this guy. Oh, man. This guy still doesn't move, though. Because he's a bit of a weirdo. Three res, four res. All of our res sucks. Res, you might just need to eat a hit. Or. Ugh. 
we can alternatively do that. And you're for sure going down next turn. Then no matter which one of these two you attack, like you're not you're not taking them out, you know. It ain't happening there. Alright, yeah. We good. We good here. Because yeah, you gotta move to that tile. Who are you attacking? Stay back. Yeah. Who so I figured you'd attack. But now what you gonna do, huh? You're gonna get big smack root. Ow. You still get a follow-up attack. They're not as useful if the enemy's doubling, but hey. Still something at least. Alright, yeah, I need to have a little bit of a chat here. Hi! It's not safe here. Let's recruit you our villager for the playthrough. I can't. Sorry. I'm the local doctor's son. I won't leave until I've helped the injured. You've got a lot of heart for your kid your age. Yeah, join our army. Right. Let's join forces and save those villagers. I really appreciate the help. My name's and... John. Okay, so the this villager of this game starts out as a healing class, which means that I'll have two healers, which means my healers can actually heal each other and keep on using that guard thing up. Which could well be handy there. So, okay, I can't go through unless I, uh, move you out of the way. Right. That's what's going on there. Handle with care. So, hey, let's get this thing, Bob. I can, um... Yeah, sure, let's get this. Antitoxin, I don't need it right now. I'm gonna keep on playing this music, really. Alright, yeah. Time to die! Here we go! Like this! Neat! Neat. Alright. Alright, if only I could move three tiles, I could get that there. Alright, give me this. Fun fragments. Okay. Um, you don't have a range weapon, do you? You don't. So it's fair game to just like, yeah, equip it. There we go. Jeez. I'll grab this. So yeah, I need to be adjacent if I want to do that. But hey, ten bond fragments. Okay. Bunch of stuff there. So yeah, I guess a bunch of other players looped around this way and did that. That sketched me out about my ability to save the villager, though. There's no way I can just kill you. You live with one HP. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. If I could get like one tile closer there. Sucks to suck, man! Alright, let's build up bonds over here then, I guess. Sounds perfect. Sounds perfect. Yeah. Let's give experience to our village so we don't have to make you level up once. Recruit you. <laughs> Unless it pulls like a curveball out of nowhere immediately after this. Like, get pranked! You didn't level him up because that means he's not joining you. What yeah. would that be? Yeah. All right. It would have done like a tooltip, I'd imagine, if, uh, if that were the case. All right. Let's you a thing. Oh, come on. And bond fragments. Okay. Yeah, we'll get like last little smidges of experience here before uh before the map is over. Get some experience Others and stuff. You as well. We can get plenty of stabs. I'm not worried about that at all. The stabs are just one range, right? Yeah. Just making sure it's not like the Fates Hoshido well, stabs. You. But I can just heal you as well anyway. What I can do. And... Okay, you could use the experience a little bit more. My unit could also use experience. Level 8, level 4. <laughs> My god. I'm so dang under leveled. Feels so bad. The allies have to be like right adjacent Your orders, please. to gaining bond. Just in case, I guess I'll do that. This is what we can do. Yeah. Let's go ahead and uh 100% hit rate anyway. No matter which of these I do. Get stabbed! Ready for the A crit! Sweet. I can still do more. Alright, well. There we go. Are all the Didn't even need to bring Vander after all. Alright, that map wasn't that bad. There were a few casualties. Been harder if I got the now. energy drop, but uh we owe you for that. Nothing compared to the last battle. I don't know if you should be thanking me. If I'd acted faster, I could have saved more lives. Yeah, I'm there's definitely no way out. I was getting this map perfectly this saving every villager. I'm maddening. 
without spending 3,000 years resetting here. And I don't feel like doing that. Alfred and Sigurd, yeah, they're consistently MVPs for me. You know, they're, uh, they're pretty darn strong. Ah! It's like a loose hair game, my eye. Ah, let me save. We passed the seven hour mark. Neat. Hmm. Come now, Zhang. Give the nice people a proper thank you. Oh, right. Thank you for saving our village. We saved it together. You did well today, Jean. Oh, I introduced myself to you, but I never asked your name, did I? Well, there was a lot going on. I'm the Divine Dragon. The Divine Dragon? From the land of Lethos? Oh, please forgive my rudeness. Don't mention it. Like I said, there was a lot going on at the time. What brings such a splendid personage to our humble village? I've been on a journey to defeat the Fell Dragon and bring peace to the world. The whole world? Wow. If it's all right with you, Divine One, can I come along and help? <gasps> so, what's gotten into you? My dream has always been to become a doctor so I can save people. And that hasn't changed. But with monsters running rampant, I might die before I can do that. Look what just happened. At the Divine Dragon's side, I think I can learn to fight and to heal people at the same time. Well, that's all very well for you. But what about the Divine Dragon? You'd just be a burden. Oh, I wouldn't say that. Not if what he did during that battle is anything to go by. If Sean wants to come, I don't mind. Though, I understand why you'd be worried. Well, if he has your permission, then... I can only ask that you take good care of my boy. Oh, well, Fire Emblem game shenanigans. You're actually allowing him to go. Father, I told yeah, I'll you, take your child in a war with me. Worry about me. It's not like I'm never coming home. In fact, when I do return, I'll be a first-rate doctor. You'll see. How quickly they grow up. Of course, Sean. Be a good boy, a hard worker, and an attentive student. And come home safe. I will. Thank you, both of you. I can't wait to start working alongside the Divine Dragon. The feeling is mutual, Jean. I have a hunch that I'll be leaning on you a lot in the days to come. We got a new unit! Who could have possibly seen that coming? Okay, so yeah, so it's like my current squad on each loading screen. The last set of units that I selected to bring into battle. That's pretty cool. That's pretty neato there. Hi! Thank you. Thanks for taking me along, Divine One. If I try hard, I'm sure I'll make my- I can make myself useful. I have to be a little British boy that asks, please, uh, may I have another? <sighs> a sad day when your boy leaves the nest. But if it's what he wants, he has my support. It may I ask? Take good care of Jean, Divine. He'll grow into a fine young man. I'm sure he has, like, either really good growth rates or aptitude or something or other. That'll make it really difficult to get him started, but yes. have him become, like, one of the strongest units in the game if you, uh, you know, if you put time into him as these villager characters typically go. The village doctor is beloved by everyone. He's incredibly kind and skilled. Oh, okay. Well, look at this place. I'm glad I get a chance to check out the things I missed while fighting. So I guess it's just going to show my units here that I brought Indeed. actively into the battle. Being surrounded by enemies is no longer so frightful. I feel I could handle any situation. Yeah, you, uh, you really carry my party, man. Honestly. That's a lot of iron ingots! Is it because I did those donations? Give me the bonuses here now or something. Your hair has such a unique color. Is that the new fashion? We're behind on the trends here. <clears throat> We're on islands surrounded by ocean. How did these monsters even get here? Must have been something about the island. It's this planet. Mm. It's something about this planet if we're going to go by Xenoblade X logic. I heard about the monsters, but I suppose I assumed our village would be fine. Um, let's see here. Wait, can I, uh, I can bring you, I guess? We got a cat! <laughs> okay, adopted! Okay, hi! Yes. Times like these, best we can do is make our tea and medicine and pray for tomorrow. Hi. Ah. Okay, it's not just the units that I brought into the battle. I saw something interesting off in the distance. I'm gonna check it out until we leave. Hmm. There's our church nearby, where we all pray to the divine dragon. Wait, what? That's you? 
Yeah, sorry, I haven't been answering your prayers. I've, it's it's crazy. I'm, you know, I've been taking messages and stuff like that, but so many people have been calling me. Like, it's crazy. I don't even know where to begin. I'm a little bit swamped. I'm sorry, man. A scenery could not have, could have leapt from a book, but kind? No, that would be telling. Yes. We dry the peels of the oranges we harvest and use them for our medicine and tea. All right, Nito. Hi. Yeah, we didn't bring you into this battle. Visiting so many different places does wonders to expand one's horizons. I'm just gonna yank your oranges. Here you are. Aside from tea, we are renowned for oranges. Will it take some as a token of our thanks? Yeah, I, I already did before you even gave the offer there. But yeah, easy pitfall to fall into for new Fire Emblem players is to rely too much on the pre-promoted unit. I'm uh, gonna hopefully not fall too much into that pitfall. I've had to rely on him a decent bit in some of the uh, some of the maps here, but this time we were able to get by. Ah. We process our tea in a special workshop. Once I believe, can yield lots of unique results. At least most of the time that I'm using Vander, it's usually just like face tank or do damage to an enemy, not necessarily kill an enemy. Sure. So I try to keep the brunt of experience for other units wherever I can. Is the case adopted? Alright, yeah, I'm just gonna yoink all your things around here. Rice! Hi. Um... Tea is a simple, happy thing. Focusing on my work helps distract me from the war. Hi! Thank you. I can't thank you enough for saving our crops. Tea from these fields is our livelihood. I'm just going around here yoinking everything. Yoink more oranges! Ah. Oranges are wondrously good for your health. They taste brilliant too. Yeah, oranges are pretty good. Quite frankly. Thank you. We're so very grateful to you. Please, let us toast you for tea once the war is over. Yes. Our tea is so delicious that the princess herself visits us in disguise. That's the rumor, anyway. Okay, nothing over, uh, over here. Maybe, like, this layout will be better for something like this. In case anyone wants to see the map. Oh, well. Probably not too important. Hi! Yeah, I guess we just go around adopting all kinds of, all kinds of animals. In the case. Adopted! Hi! Right. I didn't do bad. Wait. I didn't do bad just now. Chuck it up to either chuck it up either to my muscles or your guidance. Okay. Uh hi. <sighs> Real battle's not quite like training. It's been tough, but I'm getting the hang of it. Well, you're doing pretty Consider good. This. Apart from the fact that your res sucks, usually, you know, archers, snipers, and fire emblem have pretty good res, but maybe this game changes that. Bit by bit, I grow stronger in the hope that I can be of service to you. Or maybe because she's like the dedicated strength archer. She's gonna have low res and like a more all-around archer that maybe we recruit later would have yeah. better res. Oh, well, it could be those creatures are lured here by the scent of. Oh, it's not possible. Mm -hmm. It may I ask. Take good care of Jean Divine. Oh, I I think I saw this all right. Yeah, I think I've talked to everyone now, right? I think we uh I think we did all the things. Yeah, I think we good here, right? What? Too much for fighting for our little town. If I missed any one, then it sucks. Hmm. Talk to you, right? It seems like I put on more muscle. So, but it makes me a better combatant. Yeah, I didn't talk to you. I think I've talked to everyone now. Um, I guess I'll check if there's anything new on the world map, but I doubt it. Like, I would assume that we would have to wait until we complete new full-on chapters before we uh get new things on the map. Bond conversations, yeah. Yeah, so next time we'll end up going here. It's starting to get late, so I'll, you know, do some things in the Somniel before wrapping things up because I have a smidge of time here. Okay, you can see what kind of things you can get from there and stuff. Interesting. Alright, let's... Cross travel. Somniel. Yes. Yes, let's do that. Let's go to the Somniel. Let's switch back to this layout. Hi. Hi, Lily. How are you? All right, let's see what we have in the Somniel. Let us see here. Um, hi. <laughs> After I fight side by side with someone, I find myself seeking them out in the Somniel. Yeah, we've heard that. Um. I wonder if they have any pickle making tools. What kind of pickles do you like to buy? Well, I don't know if there. I didn't realize there was multiple kinds of pickle. I guess, you know, you can pickle different kinds of things. Do those all fun fall under the label of pickle, though? Like, I know those fall under the label of something that has been pickled, but do they still fall under the label of pickles? Because I assume that the label of pickles is just, like, pickled cucumbers. It's like this. What's homeland is a continent adjacent to my own birthplace? To think that we would meet here. 
So what's the logic behind like the actual emblems then in that uh in that case? Are they uh spirits of uh characters? But, like I'm just like if that is for sure the case where Selica can tell you like, oh yeah, Marth right adjacent to my homeland, it's crazy that we meet here. It's like, wait, how does this work actually then? I was never told that Ferene held a second ring. Yes, we saw that. I believe. We'll collect items and stuff. Wink. Nuts. Oh, there's another thing. Spirit gem. Alright. I don't know what like a spirit gem is, but maybe someone will end up liking that. This way we go. More nuts! Whee! Orange. So... I was about to say, can I tap Amiibo again, or is it, like, per day? I remember seeing the countdown last time that we were there, so... It is indeed per day. I think we've seen your thing, Bob. All right. Like, you hear the scene is very picturesque. I appreciate you letting me stick around. I don't remember if that was the thing that you said before. I assume so. So I assume, like, the dialogue changes as you do, like, story chapters and stuff like that. Because, yeah, this will be, like, the countdown until, uh, the next day. Why is my computer going crazy? Sometimes when it makes that sound, it means that OBS disconnected. It seems like that's not the case. That would have sucked. But it gave me a little bit of a spook so, there. Prepare for the coming battle. Desire further training. I should be your partner. Thanks, Sigurd. Well, then. you all set. I can take you to shine where the ring of the dawn maiden is. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we'll do that next stream in a stream. This is what we shall do. So let's see here. Oh, hi. <laughs> yeah, this is fun. You make close watch and make sure nobody's struggling in the water. Alright, yeah, we, uh, recruit a literal tiny child into our army. Which, speaking of... Well, let's see here. So, yeah, starting out at level 1. I should have figured there. Not the greatest of stats initially. Yeah. Yeah, but he has... Expertise grants unit enhanced stat growth from leveling up. I wonder what it is. If it's, like, a... I'm fairly certain in Awakening it was plus 20%. I think in a Fates they nerfed it at plus 10%. If I recall. You want a ring? Also, I don't know why everyone can only put on one ring when, you know, you have many fingers, but what do I know? Um, what do I know about stuff and junk? Um, I don't know, probably just like magic then heal better stuff. Sure. Why not? Something slapped on there. Alright, well, glad you're enjoying it here, kiddo. Welcome to the army. Hey! What I like about life here is what a workout it can be. And in the field of beautiful flowers. Alright. Yeah, we're just we're just out here recruiting young lads into the army that are too young to know any better. We're just uh pulling a United States military out here. Alright, let's yoink all these uh all these materials. Yoink. Alrighty. I can go over here. We can do the smidge of training. Is this gonna be more manure? Yep. How much of this do I have now? Ah. What have I won? Can we do some strength training? Um. Oh, I, wait. I can have a support conversation with you right here, I guess? All right. <laughs> Let's do it. Are you all right there, Divine One? Nope. Oh, auto advance. Boucheron? Why do you ask? Oh, I just thought you seemed a little worn out. Ouch. You noticed? Uh, I am feeling sort of sluggish. Hmm. That's not good. You're eating three meals a day, I hope. Yes. I don't think my diet is the issue. Well then, how about your sleep? Hmm. About the usual. Hmm. So you're eating and sleeping fine, but you still feel groggy. It could be, be in stress. A nutshell. You think so? I wouldn't be surprised. Going to war is stressful for anyone. What have you been doing as stress relief? Nothing. It hadn't even occurred to me. Why? What do you do? I have several ways to blow off steam. Like going up a mountain alone and spending some quiet time fishing. Wow. That does sound relaxing. Would you like to join me sometime? The alone part of it is optional. Really? Yes, I would love that. Please come get me the next time you head out. He's such an upstanding, wholesome guy. All right. Well, ah. Yeah, let's just see here. Can we do some strength training? Yeah, probably. <laughs> to uh, to you know, go ahead and get this you know at the ready for the next for the next stream of stream when we do the next main battle. 
So yeah, strength mega boost in the next battle, IQ mega boost in the next battle, dexterity mega boost. In. Yeah, I think push-ups is the How way to go. You, go. you know, I guess I could have done like a different exercise for the. Uh... Oh wait, what? Wait, what? Hold on, because I use this in a thumbnail. <laughs> Uh, you got this. <laughs> uh, Looking good. Anyway, I guess I could have done one of the other bonuses for that paralog since this wasn't Perfect. since it wasn't too bad. Again, I could have made it a lot harder you if I tried this. to do it perfectly, but I'm not uh I'm not gonna Looking be too good. worried about that. Imagine like if you do it nice. perfectly you get boots or something like that, I swear. Alright. Perfect. Alright. Keep it up. Oh, well, missed time. I like how uh, I like how Sami just kind of chills there as well. <laughs> I can't I can't pay attention nice. to the timing because I'm looking over at Sami there. I can't pay attention you to the mini this. game. <laughs> oh man. Looking good. My goodness. <laughs> Keep it up. I don't know if that's training with me or just you know. Nice. Cheering me on while training. Great job. <laughs> I'm so proud. Oh man, I have strength plus two in the next battle, sweet. Alright. Let's do this again sometime. <laughs> oh man. Well That was certainly something there wasn't. Wait, I could put like some more animals out here now, right? Hold on a hot second. Yeah, so I guess sure this then? It's all the ones that I have right now. So they are all out here chilling and stuff. So I guess you can view them. You can't pet them, but you can view them. So dang rigged, man. So dang rigged, I swear. Alright. Another pretty pebble. Alright. Well, gosh dang, I keep pressing X trying to like open my menu. Alright. So we have a thingrabob here with Sigurd. I visited the Divine Dragon lots of times over the years. <laughs> We're practically family. A persistent presence can form bonds deeper even than blood. They are to be cherished. I'm surprised he didn't just say, like, wow. It's kind of creepy. Go up. <laughs> Alright, skill inheritance. There we go. Alright. And then as for support conversations, seems we have a few here. Good morning, Alfred. Good morning, Celine. Training hard again, I see. Though normally I don't find you using a shovel. That's a oh yeah, it's bury this body. Too. Won't this be hazardous for the others? <laughs> oh, Celine, this isn't training. And if anything, I need to dig deeper. What in the world is the purpose of this? I overheard the kitchen staff this morning complaining that there wasn't enough water, so I'm digging a well for them. Pardon? Alfred, if the water supply is low, there's a river nearby we can fetch more from. What possessed you to decide that the solution to the problem was to dig a well? Hey, you're right. That's using your noggin. I'd better find a jug and leg it to the river. Thanks for the tip, Celine. <sighs> you haven't changed one bit, it seems. Better that you should dress in pelts and furs to warn people of your barbaric mindset. So he's not exactly the brightest then. <laughs> What's going on, huh? Hmm, nice. <sighs> I've said it before, but I really admire those muscles, Boucheron. <sighs> oh, uh, I appreciate the compliment. Your triceps are especially well developed. Mind if I feel them? Uh, anything you want, Prince Alfred. Hmm, yes. Incredible stuff. Practically a Fearnese national treasure. Forearm is perfectly sculpted, too. Wish mine was like that. Are you finished now? Oh, guess I got carried away there. You gotta admit, though, these muscles of yours are something else. I can't help but wonder what the secret is to getting beauties like these. Nothing special, really. Oh, that's what you always say. There must be some trick to it. Unless you're telling me they're all natural. How is that possible? <clears throat> That's a bit... Uh... A bit what? Is there something special about this one? No, Prince Alfred. 
It's just a bit ticklish. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? And he's not exactly very self-aware either, it seems like. Alright, so it's just those couple of support conversations then. Alright, well, I think we've done the thing. Do I want to look through the ally notebook quickly? Because, um, hold on. Cycle allies, cycle countries. Oh. Interesting. Oh, and it shows, like, when you met, because that, yeah. It's currently the 25th, because it's 13 minutes after midnight, but that's interesting how it shows that. Should I, like, do this? Height as tall as a loaf of bread, weight heavy as two peaches. Place him for the watchdog of the Samiel. When it sees Harmonia, it cheerfully chases after its old friends with Queen Lumera. <laughs> I can see that. Zoom portrait list. Wasn't there like a uh, multiple, yeah, multiple pages? Yeah, let's, uh, before we wrap things up, let's, t I just want to have a look see at what's going on here quick. Uh, initial class paladin, birthday November 26, basic info, 32nd steward of the dragon, watches over Harmonia, and sits off a little island, the Samiel. Likes knitting, cleaning, fruit, quiet places, balls of yarn, writing. Dislikes distractions from his work, parties, strong odors, oversleeping, folk food. Plan, initial class mage, birthday March 10th. Basic info, well, you're born on Mario Day. Franz Twin, 33rd steward of the dragon, following in Vander's footsteps, was present when Divine Dragon Harmonia woke. Likes the Divine Dragon, cleaning, studying, cooking, reading, pickles, philosophy. Dislikes bugs, exercise, scary stories, riding in vehicles, himself when he's in a bad mood. Okay. Marshall Monk, March 10th, Clans Twin, 33rd, yada yada, was present. Likes the Divine Dragon, flowers, fashion, exercise, beats, cheering for people. Dislikes cleaning, studying, scary stories, difficult books, lectures, the awkwardness of falling down while all alone. Alfred, initial class noble, August 8th, Crown Prince of, Crown Prince of Noor. Uh, for Rene, he arrived at Lutho's castle on the night that it was attacked, along with his chance to be sure on it. Hi. You okay? Oops. No. Um. Wait, how did I do the uh, multiple page thing? Oh, maybe it's just like as I build up their bond then. Okay, so there's not a. Okay, so I have uh, the first thing here. Okay, so this is worth looking through after we. Uh build up our bonds and stuff. I gotcha. I think I gotcha. What's ring reference, though? Oh. It's like the things you get for it there. Those user experience are... Wow. Wow. How much time do I have in this game now? Seven and a half hours. Well, we're getting there. The last chapter map took me over two hours. So, yeah, we'll see how long chapter maps in this game end up taking me. With chapter 5 next time, where we get another emblem ring, it seems like. So with that, thanks all who stopped buying and hung out for this set of shenanigans. But I'm going to be heading out of here. So with that, until next time, take care all, and goodbye, see you. I'm just now noticing how this courtyard is, uh, is the freaking design of like the 12 emblem rings and stuff like that. That's cool. That's pretty neato.